What's up ladies, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm your girl Lorna Marie. Today for you, I'm bringing you an Amazon skincare favorite. So this is everything that I use and get from Anna Amazon to tame this sensitive, problematic skin. And I'm doing a whole series here on my channel, all on my favorite Amazon products. I just did hair and makeup and I'll be doing lifestyle real soon. So don't forget to subscribe, hit that little bell notification so you're notified every single time I post a video. Don't forget to give your girl a thumbs up. I truly appreciate it. It really helps out my channel. I'll be linking everything in the down bar below for you guys, including my website that has all of my favorites in one place. So if you wanna see how I try to control this crazy skin of mine, like I said, it's sensitive and problematic, and you wanna see all the products that I love on Amazon, then just keep watching. So I'm over 30, I'm starting to notice fine lines and um, a little bit more aging under my eyes and there's just different things that I'm starting to notice. I'm not saying it's super bad, don't be coming on here and saying, oh my God, like there's nothing wrong with your skin. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, okay, everybody feels like there's something wrong with their skin because we don't compare our skin to everybody else. We compare our skin to our skin and my skin has changed. That's all that I know. I do know that it also has changed for the better. I used to have um, breakouts really easy, but I've kind of figured out why, what I need to do, and all of that good stuff. So all of these products, I feel like definitely help me, and I'm gonna show you, there's a lot. I didn't, I'm so sorry guys, I have a little bit of a sinus thing going on here. But my first product that I absolutely love, and it's my absolute favorite, is this Tao, T-A-O, I don't know if it's Tao or how you say it, but I love this thing. It's a brush and it's very dirty. I feel like people are gonna be judging me all over the place. It's super dirty because I use it all the time and it removes my makeup and I need to clean the outside now that I'm looking at it. But it's okay, you get the idea. It's what I love about this. All these brushes are very dirty even if you wash them and you clean them. They collect bacteria just sitting there. So what's amazing about this is you plug it into the wall and it turns on this like little blue light and the light basically disinfects the brush. I mean, which is amazing. So if you have a very problematic skin and you, you're like, I'm doing everything, you know, try a couple of these tricks. Number one is getting something like this that sanitizes your brush. Every single time it's just sitting there. Also, another way is, I know it sounds wasteful, but using paper towels instead of an actual towel, because even a bathroom towel, when you wash it, sometimes it doesn't get all the bacteria out. That's why it has like, some washers have the sanitation setting, but this um, really, really helps that and using a paper towel to dry your face off instead of a towel. So anyways, I really, really like this. You have got to check it out. If there's one product out of everything, this is the one. Okay, so my next product is a facial steamer. Now, I have very sensitive skin, so I can't do it very long, but it's really nice if you wanna clean your pores out or do it before a mask and you apply you know, your serums or whatever it is and then you can put a sheet mask on top. This is great for that. Mama doesn't always get me time, so when I do, I go like all out. It's like the whole spa experience. So I absolutely love this thing. And this is the Kinga. So you know they have all these random brands on Amazon, but this is just an Amazon one and it's pink and it's cute, so I really like this. Okay, so it looks like I'm doing all of my tools first. So the next one is this high frequency, portable high frequency machine. Now, this is dangerous. You have to be careful when you're using it. I'm a licensed cosmetologist, so this doesn't scare me, but for other people, it should scare you. You can burn yourself. So let me take it out. Now this is gonna look like something else. To some people because you guys have dirty minds but to the rest of us it just looks like a device that you use at the spa so here let's do this one that's for your scalp so look this is really cool you can use this on your scalp it stimulates your hair follicle i know wong 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 and um you can brush it along your scalp it stimulates um like i said your hair fo follicle to help your hair grow it has all these different attachments oh my god this is getting carried away so like this one, it helps zap, it uh, disinfects, all this on the screen, all the stuff it does, but it is amazing. So you can like zap your little pimples and all that, and you don't use it every day, <clears throat> but it's amazing uh, to do like a special facial at home, you know, on a weekly basis, whatever you want to use. And if you're pregnant, do not use this. 
Don't use any of those like things that you have um, at the spa, they're not safe. Okay, so the next tools are these brushes. This comes in a set, it comes with other, I think two other ones. I showed you guys the lip scrubbing one in my makeup. Um, I showed you guys the lip scrubbing one in my Amazon makeup favorites. So I will show you guys another picture of the full set. But this is for face masks and it's like a little flat brush. And this one is the facial cleansing brush. So you can actually like get in here like around your nose and all of that. So I really, really like this set. Okay, so the next tool that I love is my derma roller. This is, has tiny, tiny little needles and it basically punctures the top layer of your skin. They have all different sizes, so if you're really scared, you can start from beginning with a little, they have all different sizes, so in the beginning, you can start with a really, really tiny needle and then work your way up. But this rejuvenates your skin, it helps the cell turn over, and it helps um, for your products to penetrate because obviously you're puncturing the very top layer of your skin. Your skin has like different layers, the deepest layer, the next layer, all the layers. But the very top skin is the skin that's usually old that needs to be sloughed off and your products really can't penetrate. So when you puncture those like with these tiny, tiny little needles and it doesn't hurt, um, you can definitely feel it though. Um, everything gets inside and it soaks down to the very, very deepest layer of your skin where it's most important for your products to absorb. So I really, really like this. Um, I don't get to use it all the time, but I do use it every once in a while to just keep my skin um, rejuvenated. I think some people even use it every day, if I'm not mistaken, but I would look it up and make sure you look up the proper um, usage for this. So I wanted to show you guys this set. I showed you guys this set in one of my last videos that I'll link for you guys, but it's my Amazon makeup favorites. It has like the lip scrub brush. So I keep that separate. This stuff stays with my skincare. This is an under eye one. You put your under eye cream and then it just like really like soothes your skin. Oh my gosh, it feels so cool, uh, cooling. Ooh, that feels so nice. And then you just basically rub it on. When there's stuff on there, it really slides really nice. And then this one is, is like the thicker brush. It's for washing your face. So you can get really deep into those certain edges, which is nice. And then this one is for masking. This is one of the main ones that I bought it for. You can brush on your mask, which I really, really like. This is from Nurse Jamie. And I forget what technology it uses, but it has some, it's made of something that actually lifts your skin and it gives you, um, you know, a nice massage. It gives you some lymphatic drainage. Lymphatic drainage is super important when you have a lot of swelling and it's good to, um, you know, get lymphatic drainage facials. I have like the teeth grinding thing where I grind my teeth at night. It's so annoying. I actually get Botox shot right here to, um, help that because I grind my teeth so bad. I suffer from really bad migraines, so It sucks, but stuff like this like I can brush up I can rub up and it really just feels so good and it gives me some relief and then it also like lifts everything So I like this a lot. So this is the same type of concept, but this is a jade roller you do the same thing and you um, Always everything is up. You want to be lifting up Gravity is pulling everything down. So just remember when you're putting your lotion on, when you're putting anything on, always try to go in the up direction, okay? But I really like this. I honestly switch it up. I have so many different tools that I use and it just depends on my mood, what's calling me, and that's what I use. <laughs> these tools, these are the pink quartz and I feel like these are probably my new favorite like tool to use. I like those other ones, but this one, so it has like a different shape and I'll go through all three of these in, at one time after I put my serums on and stuff and I'll just give myself a massage. So it just has like, it's all angled different so you can use it in different places. So like this one, you take it across right here like this and it gets this part. It's basically shaping your face with these tools. And then this one right here, you take this one along the side like this and it gets that lymphatic drainage going and you can actually sculpt your face, which I need all the sculpting I can get because I contour the crap out of my face because it's a very round face. So this helps. So I just wanted to show you guys, this is another tool that I have. These are cupping. So you squeeze it and it suctions onto your face and then you drag it and it really just gets the blood going. And these things are powerful. So 
I have sensitive skin, so I was like, whoa. I was like, calm down. So I wanna play with these more, but I definitely wanted to show you guys, this is something I also got off of Amazon that I, I like, but um, I need to start practice using it more, but I definitely like these. Okay, so that was all of my tools. We're gonna get into all of the products now. Okay, let's get into some masks. So this is the Ginseng Collagen Boost mask and what I like about these is they're organic, they're natural, and they're, they don't have all of the chemicals. I do use products that have chemicals, okay? I try to be organic and natural as possible, but I also am not a freak about it to where I won't use anything. I just have to use it with a conscious mind, knowing what I'm putting into my skin, and do the benefits outweigh what the chemicals do to you. So you just have to make choices, girl. It's all about choices. So I try to do a balance and um, you know, do what I can and be as healthy as possible, organic as possible, but there's moments where I'm not. So anyways, I like this. This is by 100% Pure. So I have another couple of masks that I really like. This is the Andalou Naturals Instant Bright and Titan Mask. This is also um, non-GMO, single use, vitamin C brightening mask. So I really like that. Vitamin C is so good for you. This is also non-GMO, instant age defying mask by the same brand, eight berry fruit enzyme face mask. So really like these. Now I haven't got to use this yet. I just wanted to show you guys this. I got this, it's called blackhead remover with organic ingredients and vitamin E peel off mask. So I'm really interested in seeing this, but it looks like the ingredient ingredients are all really good. So. I'll let you guys know how this one turns out. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed all of my Amazon skincare favorites. If you could use anything that I showed here today, give your girl a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell. Everything's gonna be linked for you in the down bar below as well as my new website. Let me know any products that you think I should try from Amazon in the comments below. And until next time, I'm always your girl, Lorna Marie. Bye. <laughs> Makeup and what did I do? What did I do? Amazon <laughs> skincare favorites. That's my channel. I'm your Galarna girl. Hello. At Beast. Yeah. A skincare Amazon favorite. Sorry, that was so stupid. Uh -uh, uh -uh. Um. No. Okay. You think everything's going well, and then bam, not. You suck. And give your girl a thumbs up. If you can use anything that I showed you here today, give me a thumbs up. Hey, by the way, give me a thumbs up. Hey, did I mention thumbs up?